Thank you, Haley. Breaking news in the tropics. Our first alert storm team is tracking a new hurricane. And moments ago, yep. you got the new update that Lee was upgraded from a tropical storm and could get pretty strong. Yeah, and this was actually became a tropical storm at this time yesterday. Mm -hmm. So in 24 hours, now we have the fourth hurricane of the Atlantic season. This is now Hurricane Lee. As of 4 p.m., the maximum winds of 75 miles per hour. Still moving off to the west northwest. Very well put together hurricane. This is the visible satellite. You'll notice it goes dark as we're starting to lose our daylight, but you can kind of see there as some of those thunderstorms are kind of bubbling up there near the center. It's what we call the central dense overcast, a sign of a strengthening tropical cyclone. Latest forecast track basically unchanged. This will generally head north of the lesser and greater Antilles north of Puerto Rico, but look at the intensity. This is forecast to become a high end category four hurricane winds, perhaps as high as 150 miles per hour as this will continue to move in that general direction. Long term, this will slow down by the weekend and then begin to turn off to the north. The big question is when does that turn occur? Right now, the most likely scenario is this will pass between Bermuda and the U.S. Basically, wind line with where Hurricane Franklin moved last week. A couple of other areas to watch closer to Africa. Another area with a medium chance of development that will likely be a fish storm as it heads out into the central Atlantic. For us, got a, some big changes on the way. Some rain chances picking up and also some lower humidity by the weekend. We'll talk more about that aspect of our local forecast in a few minutes.